Hey everyone, how you doing today? Thought I'd show you another, uh, well, not really an update, but I believe this is the uh, final version of this uh, Merc Stinger VX, which is uh, what I ended up naming it. Uh, it got the VX. I usually go MX with any Merc, but uh, this is uh, supposed to stand for VTOL, and whatever the X stands for, I have no idea, to be honest. But uh, that's, uh, this is where it's at. Now, um, I did a lot of changes since the last time I showed this uh, creation. I uh, added another CPU block to it as well. So it's got three advanced CPU cores rather than two where it had before. And that CPU allowed me to do a number of upgrades to it. So basically it got an upgrade package. I, uh, it's got now two mini guns instead of one that was in the nose. Um, yeah, a little bit better mini gun fire and a little bit not like centered right at where the cockpit was. I thought that was so a little bit off to the side, a little bit better damage min min mitigation, but still not super far away. Um, other than that, I uh, added some more thrusters to it as well. So it's got uh, another strafing thruster per uh, per side and a couple more uh, lift thrusters in the front area. Um, but the big upgrade was actually with the shield uh, setup here. Um, before it had somewhere in the, I believe it was the 2000 ranges in the shield, um, but I added quite a few more shield parts to it. So you've got uh two chargers there's one up here and one over there and then you got five capacitors and that brings the shield to uh 40 80. so it is just uh, uh, hyped up more than it was before and it's running a, a heavy stock shield as well plus um all these shield parts in here um i added another generator to the back of it and that is down in this section here you can kind of see it spinning through the grate there um and which is just enough power uh for it to fly around while charging the uh, the shield uh, it'll get up to about 90 percent or uh, power usage when doing that but that's cool i'm i'm okay with that it's not like it will not go over 100 where i have not been able to get it over 100 no matter what i was doing so that that part is good there um yeah so more shield uh another extra gatling gun uh and a little more thrust speed so thrusters are right now on our motion looks like this so you're uh, 40 ms forward 44 strafing actually it's biggest stat 35 lifting and 40 in reverse as well only 13 down three hour 15 minute build time it does use some rares uh, so some aluminum powder here uh, pl uh, a little bit of platinum and then of course uh, estrium and zacosium 940 each on those um, cpu wise it's coming out to uh, core 7 uh, 46,000 CPU. It's using almost all of it. Uh, 45, 971 on CPU. I did also add in a quality of life thing in on the inside, so it does have a box now. Woohoo! And a trauma station. I think, it, and its general color scheme is different. Uh, obviously, it doesn't really look like the other Mercs with color, um, but I was trying to make this uh, feel a little bit more like Covert Ops kind of creation. And hence the uh, uh, with the red thrusters, I just thought it looked a little bit cooler than the uh, the blue thrusters. And with the interior lighting too, this is kind of like that you know nighttime, you know co-op or uh, covert op kind of lighting, like in some kind of craft like this. So that's why it's got a bit of the uh, it's got actually two lights in here. I had to put them on the floor. There's literally no place else I can stick those unless they interfere with you walking around. Which I really didn't want that to happen. Like if you put uh, like this light here. Um, if you didn't just like climb in here, this could disrupt your walking um, because it's on the ceiling right above there. And this is only uh, three blocks tall inside of here. So um, that's why the lights are on the floor back there. But they're out of the way and you get, have two upgrade slots here for two advanced uh, CPU cores to bring it to the full core nine if you want. And I would say if, if you did do that, you'd probably be using that extra CPU to maybe upgrade the, uh, the turrets. Or I'm hoping, and I don't know, though, if there's upgrades for, like, these plasma uh, cannons on here. Um, that would be really neat. Or, you know, the mini guns. But I figure, you know, with some extra CPU, you can do things and, and stuff. And if you, really, if you really wanted to fit another generator in here, you could probably figure it out. It probably wouldn't be very pretty, though. But uh, you could still stick stuff in here <laughs> if you wanted to. But, uh, yeah, other than that, I think it's 100% done. And, uh plan on getting it to the workshop tomorrow but i wanted to test it in game today maybe get this spawned in in the uh the current reforge eden playthrough um and see 
how it does in reality you know my hope is that the four or i'm sorry the eight uh, plasma cannons on here will be able to do as much shield damage as four laser cannons and if that rings true um it, it work it'll work out good if it doesn't that could be problematic um but if it does work then you're just going to have uh, once those shields go down you're going to have pretty good you know whole damage output on this being able to fire all eight uh, plasma guns at once at your creation which i i think would just be a significant dps uh upgrade but um yeah, overall i think it uh just flying it around and stuff too it feels pretty good the maneuverability feels good it's not jerky it's not um but it's not too like you, you can't turn i mean obviously if you want to turn faster um i usually roll into a turn uh, i think that helps a lot with your turning speed um, but if you just try to like just turn regularly um with the mouse it's a little slower for sure i think yeah anyway um that's all i've got for today just wanted to sh uh, show you this and uh i'm still contemplating the next project um beyond this one i've got some different ideas and i've seen some different ideas and comments as well and i've got to review all those and i, I just kind of want to figure out what 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 the what the next game plan is to build after this uh since this is pretty much done now um what else to build and there's uh there's some different ideas uh so i'll uh, I'll, I'll hit that on the next video but anyway uh that's all i've got for today and i'll see what happens in gameplay with this tomorrow and uh get this to the workshop tomorrow as well so y'all have yourself a great day and i'll talk to you later